And so on job losses, the General Secretary of the Maritime and Dock Workers Union of Ghana's Trade Union Congress, Daniel owusu says 150 maritime and dock workers risk losing their jobs due to the COVID-19 on port business. He said several companies operating at the port are already saddled with challenges. Josephine Ntreji has more on the following report. Ghanaian workers join the rest of the world to mark International Labor Day. The day is usually celebrated with parades and fanfare. <laughs> Various labor unions, including the Maritime Dock Workers Union of the TUC, mark it across the country. Unfortunately, to stem the spread of COVID-19, most workers were home observing social distancing protocols. I caught up with the General Secretary of the Maritime Dock Workers Union of the TUC, Daniel owusu -Kranting. I've been in the trading now for about 21 years. I've never missed one May Day. And for a number of people, some of the some of our veteran trade unions, who might have retired for a number of years, they will tell you that in their in their life ever since they joined the trade union, they have not missed one one you know May Day. So for what is going on now is is it's, it's, it's quite you know frustrating for us, but we all understand. He made a quick assessment of how COVID nineteen is having a heavy toll on companies and workers. In one particular company. We are dealing with close to about 150 redundancies. You know, the, the company was having some problems, but it had been worsened by, by COVID-19. He also cited the Ghana Ports and Harbors Authority, which has a workforce of about 4,500, as one of the companies which are struggling with operations due to the delay to implement the 20% container business offer and the pandemic. But as, as I speak to you right now, <clears throat> the COVID-19 has come to also create or worsen the issue further. And let me also say here that if we don't get the 20% container business implemented for GPH immediately, it is going to be very, very disastrous. It's not GPH alone that is going to suffer. GPH would lose a number of workers and it, it's, it's, it will not be able to play its um, um, employment generation role. Job losses, he says, is more evident as the replication of COVID-19 is devastating on business. We are not in normal times. This day was supposed to be a day for them to celebrate, let articulate their concerns for government to know. But we are not celebrating the day as it is. Justin NGJ TV3 News, Tema.